Good morning, welcome to the vlog. I am back. Sorry I had to take a few days off, but um, I'm sure you understand. I had some bits going on in the background, um, health-wise, chiropractor and stuff. Um, some treatment news and stuff, how things are working out. They paused the treatment, but I'll, it's a long story. So I thought I'd take a few days off to recover, and plus I've got some family bits going on as well, um, which is difficult. And I was debating whether I'm going to come back today or not, whether I'm going to, you know leave it another day but I just want to bring you content at the end of the day I want to bring you um content and reality but I wasn't in the place to film over the weekend um I mean over the last couple of days um so I just thought I'd start a vlog today um some good news my dad's gonna be putting a shelf up there some shelving units um as you don't know I've got a you may know I've got a wardrobe there um which is good so it's all coming together I think my dad's gonna be doing some redecorating in my room this week so that should be really cool um it's now 20 to 12 and I haven't had breakfast or anything I've just been you know going through a phase of trying to get up and trying to do something but um I just haven't had the motivation now to do that um which has been difficult, I know. Um, I think lockdown blues and COVID blues are getting to me a little bit. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, try and be uplifting to you and help encourage you today. Um, and this will encourage me as well by making a video. So um, yeah, stay tuned to this vlog. I'm meeting my friend in the town park today, which should be really cool. We're looking forward to that. That's at one o'clock, so I've got about an hour and about an hour to get something to eat and get ready and go over to the town park. And I think I'm meeting Noddy this afternoon, so nice day. And I think I'm making fish pie tonight. So yeah, really good news. So stay tuned to this vlog, and um, I'll bring you. So some I've fun. now come down to make something to eat. I think I'm going to have some eggs, some of the Linda McCartney sausages, and some portobello mushrooms. I mean, it's been a bit of a tough week. I've had um, Indians two nights this week after weighing. And it wasn't just a little Indian, so I'm just going to work on that. I feel a bit rubbish, to be honest, that I've eaten badly. Um, I shouldn't allow my mood to affect me eating, but um, I have a little bit. Um, so, yeah, back on track today. I'm going to smash this, and, you know, I've got weighing on Wednesday. So, yeah, I might just weigh Thursday this week, <laughs> because that's, that's when I meet with Simba normally, because I'm not going to the car practice at the moment until all my results come. Um... Yeah, so um, yeah, I can do that Thursday. So yeah, kind of smashed today, ready to motivate. So I've literally got my breakfast now. So I'm literally just out um, getting a coffee with my friend now. Um, should be really cool. So um, yeah, he's just gone in to get the coffee and I'm just chilling here at the minute. Um, so yeah, what I'm gonna do, just chill. And I was literally sitting with my friend in the town park and then two people walked from over from Slimming World. So I thought I recognised your voice and I don't know where I recognise them from. So it turns out they're on doing Slimming World as well and they see me on the Facebook pages and stuff. So yeah, if you're watching this, it was great to meet you. Um, really inspirational when you meet people and you just say, you know, they've been following your journey and stuff. It really inspires you. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go home now. But I'm meeting Noddy in a little while, doing some, I don't know, probably going on a little walk and stuff. I might jump in and see Tony at some point in a minute. I'm not sure, but I'll give him a call so anyway. Quick change of plan, I'm going to quickly meet Tony, and then Robert, Noddy's going to meet me there, because he's going to drop him off a paper. Then I'm going to go on a walk with Noddy after that. So yeah, let's so go I Tony. I just finished at Tony's, Nod just arrived, so I'm literally just going to walk around to my house. And um, yeah, meet him there, because obviously I can't jump in his car. Um, obviously restrictions and stuff. So yeah, I'm going to meet him at mine and we're going to go for a little bit with Noddy. How's your day? A uh, wonderful day, just nice to be out and walk in the freezing rain. You know people, from, you've got fans in Scotland on here. Oh good, I, I hope it's nice and snowy in Scotland. Uh, it is. Here we've, got, uh, we've had eight hours, of, eight hours of sunshine. But they live in Bigger, so... Bigger's the place. Bigger's, no, Glasgow. Ellswickle is a better place. Do I look like Elvis Presley? Uh, no, like, uh, more like... Sorry, I've got stuff. crumbs around my face. I just finished a, um... Hoggy. I haven't eaten much today, have I? Uh, no, Chinese, Indian and, uh, pie. <laughs> oh, man. Have you got any last words? Oh, I'm not going to die, mate. Are you looking forward to your vaccine? <laughs> Are you looking forward to your vaccine next week? Uh, yep, I can't wait. Should be good. That means then you can give me lifts and stuff. In the old days, they should give you uh, like tea and cakes when you get an injection. <laughs> <laughs> they used to, didn't they? 
should do now. I think they need about 10 million cakes and 10 million cakes. Mars bars. Um, I'm just going to prepare some shepherd's pie. Um, not going to put it in the oven yet. I'm just going to prepare it and just, um, just heat it up later. Because um, it's only, what, quarter past four. So um, I'm just going to prepare it all, cook the mince, cut the onion up. And, um, yeah, it should be good. I hope you're having a great day and enjoying this vlog. And glad to be back on the vlogs. And, yeah, so I'm going to prepare this. My feet are hurting a little bit. But, um, yeah, I'll see what I can do. I've got some shepherd's pie, this is sim free. There might be a bit of sinful gravy, but I'll work it out later. But yeah, not a bad dinner, so I'm gonna enjoy the dinner. My mum's got some as well, and I've got some leftovers for tomorrow, I think. So yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this now. Hello, everyone. Um, let's get some better lighting first. There we are, that's better. Um, I just wanted to come on here and just tell you, just apologize really, and say sorry that I had um, gone off for two days. I. A lot of things have gone on about my foot and stuff. Bear with me. I'm going to give you some information. This might take a while. Um, so, I went for a foot appointment on Thursday. And I was looking forward to it. And I had a reassessment on my feet, basically. And they were basically talking... Like, they reassessed my feet. You know, got me to do certain exercises. And they basically had a chat through with me about treatment, etc. Which was... Okay, I guess, but financially it's crippled me, like, not crippled me, but I think I spent most of my redundancy money on getting a treatment. It hasn't worked, um, but it's all a process, you know. He said it's going to be a process and you will get, hopefully they will see some improvement. So for now, they basically put my um, care on hold until I can get the MRI scans and blood tests um, which I don't know how long that'll be I mean I'm just waiting for the doctors to call me to be honest and just see when I can get it done because I really want to get done soon because obviously I've got to wait for my treatment if you know what I mean um, so I just left that meet like left the meeting feeling so drained because also they want to introduce some massage muscle massages and stuff after my treatment and see how that goes. But I just left the meeting feeling so drained. I went in the car on the way home and I was just so drained. I was thinking about so many different things because I... It's been worrying me about my future, like, if I'll be stuck with this. Because I don't really want that. I want to, you know, progress. I want to be able to do normal daily activities, like go for a walk even. And, you know, do that sort of thing again. Um, even just go for a run in the morning. I'd love to be able to do that and... You know, my feet are really set me back, and that's really set me back, and it's really affected my mood. Um, I don't want to say depression, but it has really affected my mood, and, you know, that's why I wasn't vlogging, basically, and I've had some other family bits I found out today, which sort of knocked me a little bit. Um, so, yeah, life's tough. Life is tough sometimes. There's a lot of nitty-gritty in my life, and probably your life as well. I mean, we all go through things, we all go through struggles, we go through, you know, I go through things as much as you, but I try and not ignore the f bad things, but I like to not focus on it, so I can focus on the positives, focus on all the positive mindsets, focus on helping you with your weight loss journeys, and it's difficult, I guess, um, trying to balance it, and I just the last couple of days, I just felt like I haven't been able to do that, and I didn't want to come on here and give negative vibes. So I understand. I've got. I mean, I've received Instagram messages from you guys asking no vlog, no vlog. Hope you're alright and stuff, which has really touched me. And seeing those people in a town park today has um, really encouraged me. So yeah, I am back vlogging. Thankfully, um, I know it was only two days, but it feels a lot longer than that, and I just. I don't know, I just guess for vlogs, you know, I got a bit used to doing them and I wasn't doing it because I liked it. But now I feel fresh as anything. I'm ready to bring you content, ready 
you know, I've eaten some bad things over the last couple of days, but it's not about, I'm going to leave it behind and focus on the new things. I know this is a bit of a long video, so I want to, you know, praise you and thank you for watching all the way through. Leave a like and leave a comment and tell me if you've watched all the way through or not. But, um, yeah, I just want to thank you for your support and the immense support on Instagram. You know, on the comments on the videos has really been the lifeline for me. And I just want to appreciate you. And I look forward to seeing you in tomorrow's video. Subscribe to my channel. We're on 189 subscribers now. So almost at 200. I'd love to be able to hit by 200 by the end of this lockdown. And come out 200 subscribers. So let's do this, guys. You are awesome. You are one of a kind. And I look forward to seeing you in tomorrow's video. And seeing you in the comments. Bye-bye.